Mark, fantastic payrolls figures this week, and it's just a shame that we spent so much time thinking about trade wars and not the fundamentals of the U.S. economy. Can the administration get the focus back? Uh, well, I think that our focus remains on how we're going to continue to grow the American economy. I think that we've had uh, terrific growth. Obviously, the February report of 300 plus thousand new jobs is exciting, but I think that builds on upward revisions to December and January numbers, as well as the number of 4.4 million workers who have received either a bonus or a pay raise since tax relief was passed. And that accounts over 432 companies who have made those announcements. And those are only ones that are public that we know of. So we think that this economy is humming along. We're encouraged with the turnaround. And uh, we think it's building not only on the tax relief package, but also what we started last year, which was the regulatory relief and unleashing the economy from the regulatory burden that the Obama yeah. administration had placed on it. So, Mark, looking at the fundamentals at the moment, there is a break in the Republican Party. The Republican Party pushing back against your administration about what you've been doing with trade and what you've been talking about as far as trade is concerned for much of the last week. How do you build some of those broken bridges with the Republican Party that have been created over the last week over the issue of trade? Well, let, let me step back a, a couple points, because I don't think that it's really in the last week. I think throughout, as you go back to the campaign in 2016, the president was very clear these are the policies he would pursue, and there were plenty of traditional Republicans who opposed these policies. So uh, this president won because he pulled together a coalition of not just Republicans, but also independents and Democrats who supported his agenda. The reality is that we have a very close working relationship with Chairman Brady, with Chairman Hatch, with Speaker yeah. Ryan, Leader McConnell, on many fronts. And so the, we understand their perspective, but it's not as if this uh, was a surprise. This is something the president campaigned on. He's been talking about for 13 months. And we had many members, many meetings with these members to articulate where we were headed with this policy. So uh, uh, we understand that we're not going to be on everything all the time, but we, we really appreciate the strong relationship we have with those leaders.